Good evening, I'm Justin Betty. Today, Wisconsin passed the milestone of 200,000 COVID-19 cases since the pandemic began. Those according to latest numbers from the Department of Health Services, just shy of 2,000 people across the state have died from COVID-19. And healthcare leaders have been busy trying to handle it all recently. The Chicago and Chippewa Communities Health Clinic added over 1,000 new patients to its register since the pandemic began. News Watch 12's Cooper Henkel joins us now live in studio with more on their strategy. Cooper? Health clinic leaders say aggressive testing combined with an early adaptation of new testing technologies helped to spread the slow, I'm sorry, helped to slow the spread of COVID-19 among the community. But as health director Jamie Zarda told me, their capacity is just beginning to expand. And that's Life key. does not stop when the pandemic came. And so we know people have to go shopping. People have to go to appointments. Health director Jamie Zarda says the Chicago and Chippewa community has made it a priority to stay safe during the COVID-19 pandemic. You're being exposed every day to COVID-19. We are just wanting to make sure that it does not come to this community. And if it does, it's very limited that it comes to the community. And making sure they could keep up with the community's needs meant adapting rapid testing early on. We don't just test people that call and want to test. We test all of our employees weekly. We test any vendor that's coming into our community as well as any contractor that comes into our community. That quick turnaround also enables for quick contact tracing. Other than the state, which may take a couple days to finish contact tracing, we are able to finish contact tracing within a couple hours. Helping to keep the clinic and its staff healthy. We are able to let them know about a member in their community that who has tested positive and they are able to um, stop that spread right away. They also have their first antibody testing event this Tuesday, the 27th. Um, you need a doctor's visit to go with that. So what we do is a telephonic visit and then you um, will come in and have the lab drawn. That will tell you whether you have ever had COVID or not, if you have the antibodies in your system. That helps medical providers track the effects of COVID-19 on people in the long term. Who's holding the antibodies? How long are we holding them? Um, you know, what the values are. And that is going to enable us to share with Indian Health Services and other people um, the data. This proactive, progressive testing procedure is leading to a permanent expansion of the clinic. We are expanding by opening a pharmacy. Um, getting a larger lab. So those are all things that will help us for years to come, as well as um, possibly expanding more. The SCC Health Clinic will be holding their first antibody testing event tomorrow. You do need to call in for an appointment. You can use the number here on your screen. You can find all this information on our website, wjfw.com as well. drive through testing will be available. This isn't going to be their only testing event, so if you can't make it tomorrow, don't worry. The clinic hopes to have similar events once or twice a month going forward. Justin? Thanks, Cooper.